Hey, Tubies, it's Psychic Bob. Well, here it is Sunday. It is so good to be back with you guys. You guys have been wonderful. I want to say thank you. Thank you to all of you who have been so patient with me the last few days. I was thinking Bob's had a real busy schedule. A lot of private readings. And, you know, I've been a little behind on horoscopes. So, uh, anyways, I do appreciate you, you tuning in. We do have horoscopes for yesterday posted. So, if you haven't seen your horoscope yesterday, definitely check that out. And I want to say a big uh, thank you to all of you who came out to last night, to our Saturday night seance. That was so much fun. Um... I love the channel. I really do. You know, if um, if you're new here and you're still learning about my channel, uh, you know, you might want to learn more a little bit about Psychic Bob through checking out my books. These are some books I sell over on my website at robert-hickman.com. I'll put the link down below. But uh, I have a tab up at the top that says books. And if you click on that, you can see the books that I sell. And all the books on my site are my own creation. I wrote them and I published them. So, uh, definitely check them out. This one especially I recommend. It's one of my favorite books, Messages from Rose. Uh, that's my spirit guide, Rose, there. And uh, we have a lot of fun, uh, you know, over on my site. You know, it's a great place to also get your daily horoscopes. So definitely, you know, check it out. Pop over there, robert-hickman.com, and uh, see what there is to see. Well, you know, guys, I just want to give you an update also on horoscopes. Today, I'm just a little behind. So what we're going to do is we're going to skip horoscopes for today. But this evening, I'm going to put out tomorrow's horoscopes. I'm trying to get back on schedule so I have them out earlier than the, you know, rather than later. So this afternoon, later today, I'm going to put out our horoscopes that will be for Monday. So I hope you forgive Psyche Bob. I'm not going to have the time today to get in another horoscopes video. So we're just going to try to get back on track of getting them out early. And I'll have a, a horoscopes out this afternoon, which will be for tomorrow, for Monday. Uh, so the horoscopes that will be posted next will be for Monday, February 20th. Okay, so thank you for your patience. Anyways, I wanted to just kind of come here today and just keep it light. You know, I work a lot. And sometimes I just want to goof off and not always be serious. And today's one of those days where I just thought we'd have some kind of relaxing time and Talk about just some other things. You know, one of my new passions, for those who've been following my channel, is I just bought myself a, uh, a Louis Vuitton bag. And I wanted to come here and show you kind of how that's coming along. Uh, you guys may remember, if you didn't see, well, if you did see that video, you know that I just got it and I just literally unboxed it. Well, it's been a few days now and I've been stretching the bag out by putting stuff in it. And I thought I would come here and show it to you. So as you can see, the bag is looking really good now. Uh, it was much more wrinkled, and uh, we've been putting stuff in it to kind of stretch it out and make it look really good. So uh, anyways, it's coming along. You know, the, the wrinkles come out. It takes a few weeks sometimes. But every day, what you want to do is just kind of, if you have one of these bags, whenever you're not using it, put stuff in it to help keep the form. It'll keep the wrinkles down. But I want to come and show you my Vuitton bag that it's really looking quite good. Um, anyways, I also want to show you another little trick here. I think you guys might be interested in seeing this. Um, so, you know, I've just been keeping my bag stuffed with bubble wrap and towels. I got my Giorgio towels here. <laughs> Giorgio Beverly Hills. We're going to have more stuff on Giorgio Beverly Hills soon. I got tissue in here. You know, it takes a while to uh, to stretch these bags out. So I recommend that you use, you know, soft items. Put tissue paper in it, uh, bubble wrap. A lot of people I've seen on YouTube are using these, um, you know, those air bags. You get bags that are filled with air. That's a wonderful way, and it keeps your bag light. But anyways, I just put a few things in. And as you can see, the inside of my bag, it's looking good. Um... But I want to show you something new here that I just discovered. I tell you, there is a whole world around Louis Vuitton bags. Um, I have a thing here called a base shaper. That's right. Let me take it out of my bag here. I'm going to show this to you. This is a really cool invention. This is called a base shaper. 
and it's made to go in the bottom of bags, the soft body bags. Let me let me just kind of explain this to you. The Louis Vuitton bag has no support structure. Now, as you can see, the bottom is nice and flat, but what happens is when you start putting stuff down in your bag, uh, the bag starts to sag. It starts to lose shape. So when I put my books down in, well, see, this one's pretty strong, but after a while, the bag will start to sag and lose shape, and it strains the bag, uh, many people say. So what you want to do is get what's called a base shaper, and that's what I got today. Um, you can buy these, actually, um, either at Etsy or eBay. Um, but I have to tell you, not all base shapers are the same. Don't go for the cheapest. I spent about uh, $17, $18 for this, but it's custom made. There's uh, There are companies who literally sit and hand cut base shapers. This one's made of plexiglass, and you can see it's actually quite thick. It, it won't bend, and it's very solid. Uh, this is a great way to preserve your, your Louis Vuitton bag. Now, the secret to base shapers is they're all custom made. So you want to um, make sure you know what size of bag you have. So like I have the Louis Vuitton Speedy 35. And if you're somebody and you're not sure, you know, you think, well, I can't find a marking on my bag. Um, and you don't know, you don't have a Vuitton here. What you do is get a tape measure. And measure your bag from the bottom side, from end to end. So we put our stick, our one end of our tape measure here. Oh, I'm dropping stuff here. Think like about it's not too coordinated. But you put one end of your bag here. Now you have to have centimeters, uh, and then the other one down at the other. Oops, let's stretch this out so you get the full length. And when you measure it, it literally comes down to, as I should say. I can't see it. Yes, 35. Okay, so it's 35 centimeters, which it should be. So measure from end to end, and as you see there, it's 35 centimeters. So that means it's a speedy 35. So if you measure your bag and it's a different number, that's the brand of speedy is. Now there are four brands of speedy. There's 25, 30, 35 and 40. So it's good if you're not sure to definitely get a tape measure and measure your bag because you can't return these. They're custom made for each order. So I have a Speedy 35. So I bought this and this beautiful plexiglass piece came. I got to dust it. I've already messed it up. I've not spilled stuff on it. But all you do is then take that, put that down in the bottom of your bag. If it's cut properly, which mine was, thank goodness, it will fit. Oops, it'll fit perfectly. Hold on just a second. There we go. Now, as you see, it's well, it's kind of hard to see, but inside the base shaper sits in the bag and it reaches end to end. You can see the reflection on it, it's shiny. And it will fit the width of the bag perfectly. And what this does then is it gives the bag a firm base. And so when you put stuff in your bag, such as heavy books, we'll put some heavy books in. Okay, let's see what books we got today. Nocturnal Witchcraft, Cunningham's Book of Shadows. We'll put that in. These are heavier books. You hear it hits a hard bottom. And look, when you hold the bag, the base stays firm, it does not sag, and it gives more strength, structural support to the bag by holding it up and keeping it from stretching. So I recommend, you know, if you get a Speedy bag, a Louis Vuitton Speedy, definitely invest in a base shaper. Uh, you know, it's one of these things, who would have known, right? <laughs> I tell you, I'm learning so much about the world of Vuitton. It's a whole world in itself, one that St. Bob didn't know a thing about. I thought I knew Vuitton, but I didn't know Vuitton. So anyways, now I got my bag shaper, and that's really helped preserve my bag. And I really, I've been enjoying this bag. I've been going out everywhere and traveling with it, and I get a lot of compliments. People say, oh, I love your bag. 
And, you know, I didn't buy it really to please other people. I bought it to please myself. But it's nice that people appreciate it and, and enjoy it and see the value in a Vuitton bag. So I have a lot of fun with it. And uh, I just want to come here and, and share that with you today. So, you know, it's Sunday afternoon and I'm just going to take it a little light today. Um, I got a little read, a few readings later on today. By the way, if you're interested in getting on my schedule for reading, uh, you can write to me at readings at robert-hickman.com. That's my email. Um, or you can also call my office at 571-483-2112 uh, and get on my schedule. And if you'd like to read a little bit more about my readings, definitely go to my website. So you see, we got a lot going on here at Spirit Channel, but I... Uh, you know, on today, it's it's Sunday. I'm just trying to keep it light. I'm trying to chill out. So, um, you know, I'm just curious, what are you guys doing today? Do you, know, do you ever have a day that's kind of your chill day? I'm not doing a lot today. I'm really keeping it kind of kind of low and kind of light, you know. I think that's the best way to be. I really do. Um, you know, I might today... Uh, you know, go out and go buy some snacks. I'm still up on the air on that one, huh? Should we go to CVS? I don't know. Let me think about it. <laughs> I'll get back to you on that. If we go to CVS, I'll bring you along. But anyway, so I just want to come here today and, you know, share these thoughts with you, show you my bag. Uh, be here on Wiccan Wednesday. We're going to have something really cool this week. I'm going to talk about bag charms, about how to use magical charms with your bag. You know, a lot of you ladies out there watch me, you carry bags. And I know a lot of guys carry bags too. So, you know, um, we as, you know, magical practitioners should enchant our bags. So I'm going to show you on Wednesday some techniques to put a little magic in your bag. So make sure to be here for Wicked Wednesday this week. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. You know, for those of you who are new here, you're still learning our schedule. But, you know, our schedule goes something like this. Usually on Sunday, it's this kind of vlog day. We go out and do something uh, kind of laid back. On Monday, it's moon day. And usually we talk about some aspect of the moon or moon magic. Tuesday, we have messages from the spirit world. And that's where I do little readings for everybody. Um, on Wednesday... We do Wiccan Wednesday. So as I said, this Wednesday, we're going to talk about charms and magic for your bag that you carry every day. And then uh, Thursday, we have Zodiac Thursday. And now, just so you guys know, this Thursday, we're going to start a new tradition of people write in with you know questions, and I'm going to answer them from an astrology perspective. Um, right now, I'm still getting used to this, so I'd like you to limit it to just maybe one or two questions. Um, this is not the time to ask about spirit guides. If you want spirit guide messages and messages from the other side, that's on, on messages uh, from the spirit world on Tuesday. Uh, but this is going to be on Thursday, our astrology. We're going to look at kind of timing around events. And, you know, if you've got important events coming up, like maybe you're getting married and you're saying, well, Bob, should I get married on June 20th or on July 15th? We can look at that from an astrological place and see what days would be the best according to the alignment of the planets. So we're going to start that on Thursday. That's going to be part of Zodiac Thursday. And we're going to run a little chart and I'll show you your chart around your question and, and we'll interpret it for you. So I think that will be a lot of fun. And then on Friday, we have UFO Friday. And that's really great. We're going to go out and explore UFOlogy. We're going to study the skies and watch for UFOs and talk about the mysteries and the phenomena all around that. And then on Saturday, we got Saturday Seance. So, you know, there is something every day here for you at Spirit Channel. And in between all that, we've got daily horoscopes. So, you know, I'm really trying to, to give you guys what you've been asking for. A lot of you have been writing, say you want these programs. And say Bob's hearing you, you know, I really am. So... I'm just glad to be here with you. And, uh, you know, I just want to want to share those thoughts with you today. Well, guys, I tell you, I must be insane. I don't know what it is, but I have decided 
to go out to CVS and pick up some snacks this afternoon. So I'm packing my Louis Vuitton bag here, getting ready to go. And, you know, um, I should probably do a video. Actually, we'll do that on Wednesday. What's in my bag? as well when we talk about magic for the bag. Um, but anyways, one of my little treasures I found, I want to show you guys this. I'm going to tell you how quality Louis Vuitton is. This is my Louis Vuitton card case. Now this is an authentic card case. I bought this back in, it was around 1990, I think. So what's that? Now it's, so it's like, oh my God, 27 years? Wow. I bought this at Louis Vuitton store. I went in personally bought it, so it's not a fake. But I use this to carry my business cards in. And I don't know if I ever showed you guys my Psychic Bob card. For if you come for an in-person reading, you get one of these cards. But see, there you go. It says Bob Hickman, Psychic Medium, gives my address, my phone number. On the back, it's got my website. Isn't that cool? And a mystical triangle. I kind of thought this is neat, this triangle, because it kind of looks like a goddess symbol. And it also looks like a UFO. So kind of mystical. Anyway, so I carry these in my Vuitton card case. Now, I've had this card case for 20, almost 27 years, and it's got a little wear. I'm not going to lie. It's not perfect. You can kind of see that it's got some scuffs. I need to buff it up a little bit, but it's made of canvas and leather, and it's got two slots in it, a front slot and then a back slot. And so it holds a lot of stuff, but I've had this literally for 27 years. It's been on a lot of adventures around the world with me. But uh, anyway, since I got my Louis Vuitton bag, I said, you know what? My card case got to go in my Louis Vuitton bag. So anyways, I'm going to put that in there because you never know when you might run into somebody. I get, I run into people all the time. I'll be out and I'll see them and they'll say, oh my God, Psyche Bob, and I'll have a card to give them. So uh, but anyways, yeah, I'm gonna carry that in my bag, and I think we're gonna we're gonna head out and have an adventure day. It's actually pretty warm here today, so you know shouldn't be too bad out there. But I'm gonna put on my shades. I got my bag here. Actually, I gotta put my strap on my bag. Hold on, let me find that. Where did I put that? Okay, here's my strap. I found it. So now, of course, I know I'm committing a sin by some Louis Vuitton affectionados, but say like Bob lives on the edge. What can I say? So I'm going to hook my strap on my bag here. I tell you, I'm really looking forward to when it's getting warmer. I don't have to wear any coats. And I can just wear my pentacle t-shirts and walk out in the sun and carry my Louis Vuitton bag. I tell you, I am a total believer in Vuitton. I really am. See that great? Now that just hit, hooks on my bag and then I just, just sling it on my shoulder here. I just crop. I like to wear as a, they call it a crossbody bag. That's a new term I learned. You know, it's like Bob's getting all into this world of bags. <laughs> as I said, it's a whole world in itself. But I got on my crossbody bag here and now I'm ready to go be on the town. How you like that, huh? It's like Bob is styling. All right, well, I'm going to put on my shades. I'll see you guys outside. <laughs> Come on along. Hey, TVs. Well, I tell you, I'm out walking. My gosh, it's warmer than I expected. I didn't even have to wear my jacket. I just got on a lightweight sweater. And I'm traveling with my Louis Vuitton bag. We traveling in style. So there we go. Well, you know, I'm thinking, it's so beautiful. I think I'll go get something to eat. And then we'll go to CVS. So, as I really love walking today, it is just like it's like spring. You know, today I feel like going up to Shooter McGee's. It's a little local restaurant. I have a lot of fun there. We're gonna cut through the parking lot here of the fire department. Look what they got here, Tubies. A big fire truck. Isn't that cool? Wow, that's really amazing. You don't get to see this every day in a YouTube video. Alexander Fire Department. Oh, they got the flag on there. That's kind of neat, huh? What do you think? Did you see Psyche Bob driving one of these? <laughs> oh, Lord, help us all. Everybody's house would burn down and I'd create car accidents on the way. 
Ah, it's just good to walk. You know, for those of you who have a lot of stress in your lives, you got to make sure to get out and walk. Walking is healthy. It helps the body. It releases endorphins. And it just makes you feel good. Ah, I tell you, look at this sky today. It's really something. Blue, 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 as far as you can see. Deep blue sky. Isn't that amazing? I'm loving it. You know, this walking is making me build up an appetite. So I definitely think a little Sunday lunch is in order. Or is it brunch? Is it on Sunday? Is it always brunch? It's kind of lunchtime, but I guess on Sunday it's called brunch. I don't know. But anyways, we're going to cruise on along. Well guys, here I am at Shooter McGee's. I got here safe and sound, and I'm ready for some good food. You know, whenever I go out to lunch, I like to bring some reading material. Luckily, my Louis Vuitton bag, I can fit in it a lot of reading material. So I got this really cool book, Spirit of the Witch by Raven Gramassi. So I'm going to be reading that today. Here's the menu of Shooter McGee's. They have something good here all the time. I just love this little place. Let me take a look here. Oh, here are our daily specials. What do we got here? Today's soup, crab and corn chowder. Huh, mama's breakfast. Oh, they, got, they got a little bit of everything here. I don't know what I'm gonna have. We'll take a look at it all. I tell you too, because I have such a great time here. Everybody's like a family. Hey, Mr. J. Yeah. Hey, oh, right. Psychic Bob, how you doing? I'm good. How you doing today? Is that a brand new Louis Vuitton bag? Oh my God, do you know what that is? Yeah. yeah. Dude, it looks great. Thank you. Yeah, I got my new bag. I'm out on the town breaking it in. Hey, new season, you got to be styling, you know? <laughs> there you go. Hey, I'll take some wine. That looks good. You know what I love about Shooters is it's literally like the TV show Cheers here. Did y'all ever see that back in the 80s? You know, it's like one of those places where you go and everybody knows each other. That's what makes it fun coming here to Shooters. I know everybody and they all know me. Oh jeez, I am so excited. My lunch has arrived. Oh my god, you gotta see it. You gotta see it. <gasps> Doesn't that look good? It's a chicken quesadilla. And it's got sour cream, like a salsa type sauce, and guacamole. Yum, yum, yum. <sighs> Time to indulge. I'll see ya. Hey Tubies, it's Psyche Bob. I tell you, that was such a good lunch. Look, I even took my sweater off. It's so warm today. It's literally, I'm walking around in a t-shirt and having fun. You know, I'm having such a good day, I'm almost scared to go to CVS, because you know how it goes at CVS. Always some level of drama. But I'm going to hope for the best, and we'll see what happens. <laughs> so come on along. Well, here we are, Tubies. We're at CVS. I'm going to keep my Louis Vuitton bag close, well guarded, because you never know, especially at this place. Always an adventure. I definitely have to have some cool iced tea today on a hot day like this. It's like 80 degrees, I swear. Let's see what we got here. Got there out of everything. This is where. I don't know what it is. This CVS just sells out of everything. Darn, there's not even any. There's Arizona, but they don't have the Southern Sweet Tea. Oh, here's a Lipton. I think I'll get one of those today. Something different. We got Lipton. Yeah, this is the one I like. The brisk iced tea, the sweet tea. That's a good one if I can't get 
the other one. So I'll get one of those. Oh look, they're getting ready for Easter already. Oh my goodness. Look at that, they got Easter baskets. Oh look at the little bunnies. Aren't those cute? Little animals. Oh, these eggs look good. Oh, look, guys. You remember Peeps? When I was a little kid, I used to love these. Little chickadees. All oh, those are great. That brings back some memories for Psyche Bob. Oh, aren't they precious? Peeps. I got them in blue. I've never seen blue. I used to get yellow ones when I was a kid, and sometimes the pink. Oh, and look at this. The little peep bunnies. Oh, my God. Aren't this precious? Oh, look at the purple ones. You know I'm crazy about anything in purple. Oh, that is adorable. I'm going to have to get some of those before I go today. I love Easter. <laughs> you know, really, this is all pagan. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> well, let's see what there is to see today. I don't know. Ooh, chocolate. Yum. Ooh, there's some mint truffles. Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this giant Hershey's bar. It says giant on it. Is that a candy bar or what? Oh my gosh, I think, I, I think that's going in my basket. All right. Got my tea, got my chocolate. I don't really need chips today. I already got chips at home. I gotta buy some soap. Let's see what's going on. I'm lately into these liquid soaps like you put in your use in the shower. This is Dove. There's CBS soap. Body wash. Ooh, $6.79 for that? That's way too expensive. They have one that I really like. It's um soft soap oh here it is oh it's sold out too this is usually where it is there's one bottle of that's not the one i want gotta tell you this is, sunday is not a good day to shop i don't see a lot of drama today but i don't see any products either well maybe i'll buy dial i like this one the lavender brand i think this is a really nice one Ooh, it's six nineteen. That's a lot of money for soap. Oh well, you only live once, and you know you got to be clean. So might as well get it. That's going in my basket. Well, I tell you, I'm having actually, despite the fact I can't find anything. At least there's no drama so far. It's quiet today. I think everybody's out shopping, but not shopping at CVS. All right, well, let's go check out. Well, Tubies, I'm ready to check out. I got my basket here. I got my soap, got my tea. I decided to pick up an extra bottle of tea because it's so hot, I might want one later this evening. I got my chocolate bar. Ooh, that's a big chocolate bar. So we're just waiting. Well, I tell you guys, I must be blessed today. I had a positive experience at CVS. Got in, got my soap. Got out, no drama. Psyche like Bob's in a good mood today. So we're gonna cruise on along. Oh, Tubies, I tell you, it is so rejuvenating to be out in nature today, feeling the warm, the sunlight, the warm air. It is absolutely beautiful. Again, you can see how deep and blue our sky is. I'm loving it. I tell you, it's rejuvenating to my body, mind, and spirit. Well, I'm so glad you guys came along today for our little adventure, and, and I hope wherever you are, you're having a blessed Sunday. And uh, I want to say thank you again to all of you who came out to yesterday's video, our Saturday night seance. And if you haven't seen that, check it out. It's in the queue right before this one. And uh, I hope you'll be part of our channel and be a regular. Hit that subscribe button and join us. Like this video, favorite it, and share it with your friends as well. Thanks for being here at Spear Channel, and may all of you always blessed be.